Billionaire businessmen, Dan Grote, Hilumelu, who take the last meeting with Tinubu shows his government may protect capitalist interest activists. Dan Grote, the chairman and the CEO of the Dan Grote Group, and Ute Dola, a business business, a billionaire businessman, visited Tunubu in Abuja last Friday. I beg your pardon. The visit of Africans' richest man, Dan Grote, and Femi Ute Dola to Nigerian president elect Bola Tinubu, according to a socialist revolutionary activist, Francis. Mwakba shows that his government may protect policies that benefit capitalists in the country. Dangote, the chairman and the CEO of the Dangote Group, and Ute Dola, a billionaire businessman, visited Tunubu in Abuja last Friday. On Wednesday, Tunubu visited Tony Elumelu, the chairman of Hell's Holdings and the United Bank of Africa, PLC, at his residence in Abuja. However, the activists expressed concern about the intimacy between the country's business uh, tycoons and the president-elect in a statement issued on Thursday, explaining how it may lead to the exploration of average Nigerians. The statement reads, Capitalism simply means a few business guys exploring those that control production workers stroke proletariate through poor pay courts in benefits employ less to do more work etc for them to get richer why those workers struggle for survival all through their lifetime the capitalist businessmen in most cases have no preference of who among the bourgeoisie politicians that emerges political positions and facts. In most cases, they release funds to all of them and wish them well. What is paramount to them is that those enabling environments and policies that enable workers' exploitation continue are sustained. These capitalist politicians also dictate policies that the political class implement and those policies are usually never to improve the living standard of the working class or peanuts but to create more avenues for them to get richer through exploitation or economic sabotage i will also add that these are the same guys who get huge loans which in most cases don't pay back from banks and their partners in political offices still use taxpayers' funds to build out those banks when they collapse or in a distress. They get fees at the off official rates and trade at the black market, which it had within a minute make billions of naira. They are the VIPs that our security personnel were established to protect and run, around, run errands for and they are united irrespective of religion, ethnic group, or gender, the working class. And present are only tools for white creation, not to benefit from the wealth. The working class must unite against this exploiting class. The system that this injustice is built on is so-called capitalism, and that system has globally exploited the working class for over 500 years and requires an international working class solidarity to end this system of exploitation and then through it with a system that those who control production will control and manage the economy, socialism, he said. Hmm, Nigerians, men that does not know what he is, doing what even remember the once is done my said this country one day without him knowing i pity this my country it is normal nothing new about it as it is being practiced all over the world remember donald trump during his era in america they need to protect their oil blocks and businesses 
in Nigeria, being a major key players in the Nigerian economy. I am not talking of those making enmity with Buhari for refusing, enmity with Buhari to refusing to say first to them to import pint and fairly used human beings, it is it. Or more, eh? See jealousy and envious reactions from the Bad Loser Association of Nigeria. is getting high, higher every day by day. But sorry, Ashweju is there already. Capitalism is an evil from form of government. It's exploiting system of government. It makes rich get richer and poor get poorer. Community cooperation is the best system of government. Say no to capitalism. We are enjoying the movement. These are the men of wisdom. Why others are protesting and court case Jacoban all the way. After every election, it's common for the top businessmen to align with the elected leaders to align with the elected leaders to protect their businesses' interests. Besides, some of them sponsor campaigns of most candidates. Which government and who is the leader? To wear to fear qua God forbid. Capitalism or capitalist economy is revolter to the economy and country development. That is poor and baseless insinuational. It rather means he is fine turning strategies for private genera uh, generation of wealth for economic growth. They hold Nigeria hostage based on monopoly. Average people see them as businessmen or even philanthropists, blah, blah, blah. But of course, waiting, I know nothing. Okay, guys, these are reactions by Nigerians. What's your take on this? Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel.